It was called a blue wave in 2018 when Democrats picked up five seats in the state legislature. Several of them were females in the suburbs, like Karen Derry in the Johnston Grimes area, who ran again but lost. Now, I kind of knew going in after winning in 2018 that I'd probably have a target on my back. This year, Iowa's suburbs were also battlegrounds for Democrats hoping to pick up four seats to retake the Iowa House. Instead, Republicans gained six seats. The Republican who beat Derry is Eddie Andrews. I have been literally knocking on doors, talking with citizens from three hours a day, four hours a day, sometimes up to 12, 13 hours a day, uh, getting feedback and listening to what their issues are and what their concerns are. Andrews credits his win to meeting Iowans face to face while Democrats campaigned virtually. He is said to become only the second black Republican to serve in the Iowa legislature, the first in five decades. Andrews says he ran for one reason after losing a loved one. Last year we had a loss in our family and I made a strong commitment to our family and to myself to close all the gaps in our mental health system that I possibly could. Also family safety. Uh, people are concerned about uh, making sure that the suburbs don't end up like Seattle and Portland, to use their phrase.